hi fellas and welcome back to my channel if you are new here please don't forget to subscribe to the channel and then like this video if you enjoy it to the end it's been a while i've i mean sat in front of the camera to actually record to actually give you guys updates on what is actually going on because i've been busy with the national series and some other things with schooling also and then i've learned so many things i mean over the month which i'd love to actually share with you in relation to technology at x speed which is the software development space and some quick updates i would like to share with you guys which will be of importance if you are actually in the particular sector and if you really want to join or dive into technology or you want to learn more things about technology this video is right for you so first thing first if you are really coding and then you are still stuck at learning your html and css is something you really need to speed up things right now it's things so it's a basic and it's the most important thing so i'm talking to people who are actually already in their html and css stage and javascript stage okay maybe you'll be doing it for a quart i mean some time now maybe for about months about years and you're still doing html css and then javascript once you have the fundamentals you have the basis i mean i think it's time that you jump into these particular frameworks that we have which are angular um and then in javascript libraries okay um we have we have, we have view and then we have other i mean frameworks that you can actually try and then dive in because where the trend is actually moving it what big tech i mean or big companies are actually using in developing their websites their web applications and then so many other things if you are for the mobile you know what to go for the kotlin or the suite or i mean the uh, flutter is also there that you really need to dive in don't really waste too much time on your HTML or css and then your javascript okay when you're done with your javascript another language that you are expected to learn or know is typescript okay if you're a front-end developer okay back-end developers also use typescript but if you're a front-end developer okay i mean it's more suitable i mean using it in that way okay so as for me, I have an upcoming interview that I need to maybe I'm actually learning things around Angular and TypeScript okay, because that's what I've been learning over the months that I've been away doing my national service and schooling at the same time. It's been a very challenging road. It has been a very challenging road because it's not easy balancing and then making sure you're schooling at the same time, doing your national service and doing other site works. I mean, and doing YouTube also. In addition, it's really hard. So, all I wanted to know is just diving straight to your angular the react review to actually start learning something from that particular angle because when you get into the industry you are not actually going to post more on your html and css that you know that's if you've already learned this particular i mean fundamental the basics that i'm actually discussing i'm talking about the reason why i'm saying that is if you really really want to actually join the software development space then it's actually right for you to actually start learning these kind of frameworks these kind of technologies now that when you get into the space it's going to be much easier for you because i think i wasted too many time or too much time learning my html css javascript do the other fundamentals that you use in duplicating in a particular frameworks or that libraries okay but you need to actually speed things up okay and know how to actually use things the right way when the best practices in the tech or in the software environment okay i've learned so many i've really learned so many and i'll be sharing them bit by bit so if you really want to know much about the development space okay uh, team collaboration uh daily stand up how communication is being done the procedures the sprints the actual methodology that we use and then some other things that you really need to know okay if you really are starting from the ground up just like i am and then you really want to know some of those things i've gained those particular experience and then i'm still learning and building upon them so i love to share this with you so if you really really want to be part of this particular channel please don't forget to subscribe okay and then hit that like button i'm actually looking at learning things okay around typescript and then angular because that's the framework i'm currently learning that's the technology i'm currently learning that's the stack okay so i'm looking at something about forms okay that's forms so basically objects arrays uh, how to use surveys um how to create reusable components and then use them okay those species use them across the application so those are areas i'm hoping and you'll be asking me questions about and that's what so i'm currently preparing and then please don't forget to stick and stay and then let's see 
how we can grow this channel ask me any question in the comment section and then let's do this guys thank you